So tonight we ate at Dobra Kaka Nabra. Dobra Kasha. Kasha Nasha. Dobra Kasha Nasha. And we ate, in fact, you can see that was the table we ate at with the stuff on it. Again, we had this room to ourselves, it was very nice. And uh, as all the restaurants, they uh, have some tables out on the terrace. But we chose to eat inside. Um, you find it right on the main square. In fact, very, very easy to find because it's right under the, the town hall. There we go, the town hall tower. Dabra. And this was an interesting story because this was a, this was a restaurant that we kind of learned as we went. We actually ordered in a, not a very smart way. We ordered wrong. Next time we come, we'll order right. So another night, another place on uh, Market Square. Uh, this one, another suggestion. Dobra kasha nasza. Dobra kasha nasza. Nasza. So, so far they've given us a Polish menu, so I think most of our viewers will recognize what's on offer. Me? Not so much. Fish baked with vegetables. It's number four in main dishes. Wild boar stew, that sounds kind of nice. No more pork. Mm -hmm. But fried, ta yeah. probably fried Tatra mountain cheese. Okay, I will go for fish, what is baked. Baked fish with vegetables. Okay, perfect for you. Yeah. What, what do you prefer, green? Yeah, green tea I like, certainly black tea I love. Okay. You know, I'm British. Okay, just classical black tea. I don't, I don't, I don't well, black tea, mango, sunflower. No, I mean, that's a crime. <laughs> They're probably Highlander tea looks nice. Oh, it's rum, cherry vodka, or pure vodka. <laughs> I thought it was all three. I was like, okay. Well, you know, I'll go for a crazy tea if you want. So what did we order then? Oh, so you're knocking, you're knocking the bird's nest. There might be some like pigeon comes out and attacks you now. <laughs> so we ordered tea, crazy tea, like something like a, crazy fruit tea, like a fruit madness or something. It's the name. Okay. Uh, that includes different uh, fruits like uh, mango, strawberry, apple, and so on mixture. And then uh, I ordered vegetables, baked vegetables and uh, baked fish, baked in oven. Okay. And you, what you had? I ordered the tantric cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I ordered the tan, I don't think tantric is the right word, right? Okay, check. You have a menu, you, you keep a menu. No, cheese Tatra, Tatra mountain cheese. Tatra. Tatra. And okay. I went for the wild boar stew because I'm a bit of a wild boar myself. Okay. We didn't do the baked groats. That might be a mistake because I think that's what they're probably famous What they for. didn't do? Baked groats. What is that? Baked groats. Baked groats. Okay. So everything has got sort of a grain. Oh, we should order that. You know, something with a grain. Baked broccoli with corn, I would try really. We'll do it then, I'll ask him when he comes back. Okay. Baked broccoli with corn, pear barley. Pear barley, yes, that is nice. That's maybe their like, signature dish. Ooh. Love, I like your shirt. Thank you. Show the shirt. Wow. We went back to our favorite shop today, our favorite uh, shirt shop. Yeah. Fortuna. I like this one because it's for tuna and I love tuna. So I Do they play like, for tuna? They play for money. They play for, they play for tuna. 
<laughs> we play for tuna. It's for tuna, the shirt. It's for charity. It's for the tuna, the poor tuna. Okay. So. Okay. Miesto. Mepo. Mepo. Womicha. Mepo Womicha. Mice. Yes. Don't know what that means. Miesto Mepo Womicha. Bought a couple more shirts today. And I got a beautiful dress. Let me show the dress. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you. All from the square, all really from the square, the close to the square. So a nice okay. afternoon in the square. We watch the soccer game. We're gonna have some food, maybe we'll catch the next game. All good. Don't okay. Look. What do we have? I ordered the broccoli and the corn also. Oh, great. Thank you. Here we have our tea, our fruit tea. It's a couple of minutes more. Mm. Tantric cheese. So actually you had it before, yeah, several times already. Yes. Mm. It's a smoked cheese, fried smoked cheese, grilled smoked cheese. I think this is the better than the one we got from Bat Bat Batsufka. Batsufka. It's very nice actually. I love this. Mm. Very smoky. Quite cheesy. Mm -hmm. mm. Texture is nice. Mm. Mm. Sweet cranberry. <laughs> it's a dessert, really. Mm -hmm. It will be nice with, with tea. Can you pour for, uh, some tea for us, please? Oh, oh my god, when is, what <laughs> color is that for tea? Come on. I apologize to all of the uh, to all of the British watching. I apologize for <laughs> the sacrilege of destroying tea. You can ask. Uh, you can ask for ice cubes and to drink it as a cold tea. What? what? <laughs> Are you trying to utterly destroy <laughs> the tradition of tea? This is very nice. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's my favorite. <laughs> that is potato. Fish. Oh, great! One more stew. Excellent. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Great. Interesting. Food, yeah. And great. plates with uh, groats and fish are very hard, so don't touch them. Okay. okay. Fantastic. Thank oh, you. Oh, fish is, is uh, underneath. Yeah, yeah. Under potatoes and Okay. Salad. Great. Yes. So, so I have to swap. Uh, so when it said vegetables, it meant roast potatoes. But yeah, okay. you have cabbage salad. Um, you got okay, broccoli and survive. corn. Yeah. Oh, it still looks fantastic. Beef, 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 wild boar stew. Excellent beef, yeah? Mm -hmm. Absolutely, very, very tender. Nice flavor, very nice flavor. Yeah, very, very, very nice. Uh, that, is, oh. that is my uh, my meal. Fish? Yes, it is fish, baked fish with baked vegetables. Okay. Uh, broccoli <laughs> coming from here. From, from the barley and yeah. the corn? Actually, we made an extra, yeah? Yeah. Order it, it's barley. And that came with some white cabbage. Mm -hmm. But it's not a simple barley. This place is mm, focused on preparing different kind of kasha, how they call So it's Did type you taste of kasha. It? Yeah, I will try it. Okay. Uh, let me taste it. Yeah, so it's. I feel like it was cooked in oven, so it has very, very special flavor. Mm. I really like it. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Let me try my fish. What sort of fish? I don't remember really. They didn't say. They didn't say, they just baked Just said baked fish. Mmm, so good. Moist? Mm hmm. Okay, yeah. good. It's a winner. The fish catch the flavor. 
of um, vegetables, onions, oh, red, okay. paprika, and everything. And broth, there is a little bit of broth. Okay, so, so you really stayed pretty healthy. Oh, yeah, fine. So my love is finishing here, his too. And I'm gonna serve him barley, kasha. Kasha, mm. nasha. Yeah, a lot of corn in that, so. That's fine. That's fine? Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah, it's very nice. Mm -hmm. Healthy. Yeah. It little. looks like it's not interesting, but it's interesting. Mm -hmm. The corn, you know, obviously makes it sweet mm -hmm. and juicy. Mm -hmm. And it's filling you so nice. Filling? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Let me it. try the cabbage. Yes, the cabbage. Oh, it's cabbage with cucumber. This I like, this cabbage. Mm, I love this sauce, it's so good for me. Oh, spicy a little bit. This cabbage with cucumber, mm -hmm. it's like a sweet dressing. Mm -hmm. This would be great, like on a kebab. <laughs> <laughs> it's like crunchy. Yeah. It's like perfect for it's uh, what needs, yeah. kebab meat. Mm. It's a lot more interesting when you add the grains. Sure. I think we chose, grains, we chose from the wrong yeah. half of the menu. Yeah. We, chose, like, the, the we went for the main courses, yeah, as uh -huh. traditionally we do. And uh, start, uh, and it was actually kind of dessert that we started with cheese, yeah, with smoked cheese. Yeah, it started, obviously, it started, but it was sweet. Mm -hmm. So it's very easy to break your appetite <laughs> when you start with sweet. But they were small. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, yeah, we, and it was in time because we had our tea, fruit tea, so we had fruit tea with that smoked cheese. And then, yeah, we noticed in the menu that there are grains, different kind of grains, and we ordered uh, barley with, with uh, broccoli. Yeah? yeah, you know, I mean, the beef stew is beef stew, right? So yeah. we've had beef stew. It's a nice beef stew. Okay, you know, the, what makes it more interesting is, some, like, I'm very surprised. I wouldn't have expected the barley and the cabbage salad mm -hmm. to sort of be the highlight of the meal. Mm -hmm. But the food is way more interesting than mm -hmm. what it is. Mm -hmm. It could be amazing, amazing just uh, a place for vegetarians, you know? Because all that grains, they're filling you, they're rich, mm -hmm. uh, rich with proteins here, yeah? with uh, fibers. So great. It's very refreshing. The salads are very moist. Okay, I'm gonna eat my kiss. Okay. <laughs> so, interesting, interesting one because mm -hmm. it's a sort of unexpected meal. The thing that we expected, the things that you would have expected to be the highlight weren't. And the things that I didn't expect to be interesting were the most interesting. So the wild boar stew, for me, was nice meat stew but nothing different to the meat stews that i've had nothing exceptional and an okay stew but the barley with the corn that was this is a this garlic is sauce we decided it's a garlic yeah. cream sauce mm -hmm. I told you not a beginning. horseradish sauce and then it's about it together. the cabbage with cucumber and mint is in there and some sweet some sweetness like this yeah, one. and then you take the potatoes. I didn't think looked very inspiring. I mean, they're homemade, nice potato. Mm. But you dip it in the, <laughs> in the sauce, you dip love. it in the garlic sauce, and Fantastic. it's a winner. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So Love it. With beer, it would go so nice. Yeah, in fact, the more that I try this garlic sauce, it's outstanding. <laughs> you didn't want to try it at the very beginning, my love. So, I think this is a restaurant where you, uh, I don't know, you, uh, you have to pick carefully. Yeah, you, it's like breaking your stereotypes, you know? So I think I probably picked the worst thing by ordering the stew. Mm. Fish you would order again or not so much? Mm. Fish was only one, uh, like I didn't have a, a big choice. 
the crazy. Uh, there was only one position in menu with fish. Blood red and, tea. <laughs> and we went just like you know classical way, yeah. Yeah. Like what you think is nice. And that was a mistake because here you better go like uh, creative. Yeah. And um, explore um, yeah. more about grains than so about I think traditional milk. This is what. Nina was talking about bottle of grains mm -hmm. all around the wall and then uh, you know this is the main room just off the square you can actually look through the, this window and look through the window and, and what, what like is the this. on the paintings uh, the pictures of all them you need, this is a big central picture gray yeah. in the gray in the black yeah. frame so that is an so old fashioned oven yeah, it's, a lot of fire, it's a wood fire oven things seem to be uh -huh. pretty baked and then you know there it is that right outside the terrace so you're very close to the action you heard we heard the the jazz music from next door live music when we came in so yeah it's good i'm happy okay. i'm happy to discover this place сначала это главное ну обычные блюда там как бы заходишь заказываешь рыбу мясо выбрали что мы хотим из рыбы из мяса но мы а, абсолютно не были сфокусированы на том что это же специализируется да, 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 на странно. кашах вот на, на разных крупах потом мы до нас дошло и мы уже заказали да. ага э, что там у с... нас даже десерт есть на самом деле да 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 so what we are talking about with Nikita okay, yeah. okay. Nikita is trying to uh, will explain us now the, uh, the best should... the best uh, the best thing to do in a restaurant when you come here okay, okay. yeah because our restaurant is called Good Hour Grot, Dobra Kasha Nasha, and okay. we specialize in grots in different types, like you can see here, yeah. the inter interior. And uh, we have 13 different dishes from made from grots. Uh, main idea is buckwheat and pearl, but we also have uh, milk, Look here. milk grot. Yeah, okay. and uh, that is. Yeah, this is our specialty. Uh, buckwheat. Yeah, buckwheat, pearl, and milk grot. This is okay. our specialties, our like main idea of yeah, our restaurant. Because we... this is main dishes, fish, duck, and things right. like big ribs. It's more like for people who don't like grots, who don't get this okay. idea. It comes with potatoes, like mm -hmm. yeah. simple tourist version. Mm -hmm. right. But uh, no, what every a shame. Uh, simple tourist version. Let me try. <laughs> well, but it was good. <laughs> anyway, it's good. We, yeah, we yeah. called good our grots, so we should have good grots <laughs> and good dishes. Uh, so, yeah, because now focus on this place. Mm -hmm. so. This is different uh, dishes. It's all, uh, for example, like take bacon with dried plums. This mm -hmm. is bacon dried plums. It's all pre-cooked, and also we have pre-cooked uh, buckwheat. Mm -hmm. We, after this, we mix this and bake in the oven for ten more minutes, and also we serve with this sauce and salad. Okay. Yeah. And all dishes come in the same idea, and we have different optionals: vegetarian, yeah. non-vegetarian. Okay, what is non-vegetarian with meat? Like with meat. My favorite is corn pork. This is very oh. simple. This is just regular <laughs> pork good. chopped in small pieces with onion. It's served with pear barley, with garlic sauce, but I prefer yeah. it with buckwheat and barbecue. Oh, yeah. So uh, you can add buckwheat uh, of uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can like substitute. Extras, yeah, yeah, we can substitute pear for buckwheat, mm -hmm. buckwheat for pearl, but not meal because it's like all premixed together. Uh -huh, yeah. Uh -huh. Uh, but our the most popular dish and like all half Curry. of all time customers <gasps> take this. My love, it's what, what yeah. you, I catch uh, this first, yeah, mm -hmm. and you're like, oh, curry. But I hate yeah. olives, though, right? Yeah, I also uh. hate olives. That's why I eat corned pork. <laughs> okay. But uh, people who like olives, they almost every time come for this. Okay. This is like uh, all time customer yeah. special. Mm -hmm. It's like chicken curry with uh, <laughs> black olives they take a salad as white cabbage because white cabbage is our best salad. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh, that time. was excellent yeah 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 white cabbage is perfect and they also have take a draft marzo maybe like draft lager for oh okay mm. all right i told Next you that would be, uh, what, anything Actually, fish here? Any? no no no, 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 no we fish. have only one dish for and the fish, one thing like what you have yeah, so, like, yeah. Yeah. actually the garlic sauce was pretty outstanding as well yeah. that was another surprise yeah, we mixed it with uh, sour cream, I believe. Mm -hmm. It was, yeah, it was, um, but there was, uh, it was almost tasted a bit like horseradish for me. It was like a little spicy. It uh, must have been strong which, garlic. Which, which, which dish you had? had? We which had dish? the uh, broccoli and corn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this. So is it had a little kick. Yeah. Uh, well, it's not horseradish. We don't okay. have anything with this, but uh, we add also 
uh, a bit spicy garlic mm -hmm. um, uh, okay. on the top of the ground before we put it in the oven. Uh, so it's like add a lot of flavor and. Uh, okay. What oven you are talking about? Like uh, Yeah, big oven. Like uh, it's a bit similar to pizza oven, but mm. it's like not uh, uh, the oven fire, but electric. Oven. So we totally got the wrong idea coming here, didn't we? we uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. This next is time. also very unique idea. We have three restaurants in uh, the city. Like yeah. Krakow and Zakopane and Divice. Okay. But, uh, uh, to be honest, I lived in Poland for seven more, uh, a bit more years, but I never seen a restaurant with uh, groats as a Okay. And it is very ancient uh, food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, Jack said that, oh, it cannot be Polish traditional. I said, you know what? It's yeah. a traditional food. Uh, uh, like yeah, because potatoes came from America and before the like, 15th <laughs> century, everybody here in Europe, in Eastern Europe, it's girls. Girls, girls, okay. Yeah, it's also very healthy, like the gym guys eat all the time buckwheat, buckwheat with, uh, mm -hmm. with chicken. Buckwheat next time. Buckwheat next time? I don't think so. Thank you for... Thank you, Nikita, 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 yeah? Nikita. 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 Nick. Nick. All right, thanks, Nick. Thank you. We'll be back. Next time we'll get it right. Oh, wow. Wow. It was so cute. Uh, what, he was what? Did you just call him cute? His explanation was, yeah. He's, uh, he's very... Oh, yeah? He's yeah. cute person. Uh, okay. I love him. Oh, you yeah. love him? Oh, you are great. Okay, Thank we're, you. Okay, now we're leaving. <laughs> Goodbye. So, rather than usually, we think this is a restaurant where they've got the design of the menu completely wrong. Because this is the star of the show. This is what makes this restaurant this restaurant. It's about grains, even the restaurant. So it's like, what did he say? It's like our, what did he say? The our percussion. our best groats. groats. And you can see the bird eating the grains. This restaurant is all about the grains. And this is where the dishes are that are the, their best dishes. But if you look at the menu, it's kind of like these are like, it's like this is the main stuff. But when do you see a menu? You know, desserts are right here up front. You kind of go, kids' menu starters, soups, desserts, and then the main dishes, which were kind of average, which sort of look like they're the star of the show, and then it looks like these are the sort of side dishes. So I would have had these, I would have had these things on the back of the menu. Well, you know, starter, I would have had the soups. Yes, yeah, they should. But kids' not. menu desserts and main dishes should have been on the back. Mm -hmm. And this should have been like yeah, big and said, page. these are mm -hmm. our specialities. Right. And then when he started explaining all these things, like the pork and the ch curry, they sounded awesome. Yeah. So, interesting place. I, I took it like a side dish. For yeah, we game. actually... We, but we, it's an absolutely independent meal, you know, that yeah, includes... So, uh, we were like typical... and the meat. Yeah, I think they, they could have done a better job of explaining that to us when we came in, because we ordered a starter, and then we went straight to the main dishes, you know, wild boar stew i thought okay maybe that's their speciality uh -huh. it's going to be like an amazing stew but you know look the fish dish just says fish fillet doesn't even say what fish it is mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so and it's only one yeah it was nice these were nice but they were bang average these were really really good okay what they're trying to do they're trying to, to bring the satisfaction to all kind of customers yeah, yeah. tourists Okay, you're welcome. Some classical ones. Yeah, yeah, it's some a mistake. 